Howdy, y'all. Um, we are going to talk about how to find images that you are free to use during a PowerPoint or Google presentation. Um, so, like many of you are going to do, uh, I am going to head to Google to find an image. Check this out, right? So, up here on the top, when you go to Google, you got all sorts of options. Um, click on images because that's what we're looking for. And I am looking for something about the zombie apocalypse. So, oh, look, it knows what I want. So, I'm going to go check that out, right? And, ooh. Look at this. Uh, we've got all sorts of stuff. I like this one though, because this one looks really scary. So I'm gonna open this and let's take a look at it. It's loading, the internet's slow. It's still loading, the internet's still slow. Oh, there we go. Oh, that looks awesome. Look at, they all look like zombies and it looks really scary. Except you know what? I don't know if it's legal for me to use this because this isn't my picture. I can't just use any old picture that anybody takes and just put it into my presentation. That's not fair because it's like stealing all of the work that they made or all the work that they did to use this picture. So when we're looking for images, we're not going to use Google.com. All right. We're going to go to a website create, called creativecommons.org. I mean, more specifically, we're going to go to search.creativecommons.org. And what Creative Commons is, is it's a place uh, where, that just searches for things that people have uploaded to the internet, and they've said, you're free to use this. Okay. So if you look up on top, it says, I want something that I can use for commercial purposes. We're not going to sell this, so we can uncheck that box because we're not going to make any money off of it. I want something that I can modify, adapt, or build upon. We just want a picture for our presentation. We're not going to modify or adapt it at all. So I'm going to uncheck that box as well. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to figure out where I want to get this from. So I think uh, you'll notice we've got like videos and music. Um, I'm going to just look on Flickr and I'm going to see, well, actually, no, let's go to Google Images. This will be more exciting. Um, and now we've already looked on Google Images, but these are Creative Commons licensed images that I can use. So I'm just going to enter zombie and see if I can find something cool that I'm allowed to use in my presentation. So let's go. Now you'll notice it's taking me to google.com, but these are all things that I'm allowed to use while I am making my project. So, ooh, this one looks good. I'm going to take a look at this. And mm, let's take a look. Yup. So this is perfect. This is exactly what I want. So I am going to go to the image and take a look at it. Yup, that's exactly what I want. So now I can import this image into my Google presentation. You guys already know how to do that. I'm going to show you in the next video how to go about citing where you got this video from. Now again, with that Creative Commons search, if you don't find something that you like in Google Images, feel free to check out Wikipedia Commons or Flickr or OpenClipArt Library or Pixabay or Photopedia. All of these things, anything that says image here is going to get you pictures that you want to be able to use for your presentation. So don't go to Google Image to get your images for this presentation or for any presentations you do at Hillsdale. Go to search.creativecommons.org right here. And remember, you can uncheck these two things as long as you're just going to use the picture and not make any money off of it. Cool? Cool.